everyone and welcome to Nico's Kitchen's Fast Food Friday. Today we're going to be making a really fast and best of all full of flavour lunch. I'm going to be making some meatball subs. He's got budget meal Mondays, what you want Wednesdays, fast food Fridays, what else could he share? It's Nico's Kitchen where satisfying meals are prepared. So the first thing that we're going to do to get started on our meatball subs is make our meatballs. So just into a bowl, I've got some beef mince here, just some ground beef. Now if you don't want to use beef, you can use veal or pork or lamb, it really is up to you. And to the beef, I'm going to add in some minced garlic. Plus I'm going to be adding in some dried herbs. Now this is a special spaghetti mix, but it's just basil, oregano, garlic, thyme, and obviously parsley. So just add a few sprinkles of that in. Next I'm going to add in some cornflake crumbs. Now if you don't want to use cornflake crumbs or can't get them, just use normal bread crumbs. I'm also going to add in one egg. And I'm also going to season with some pepper and some salt as well. Now guys, make sure your hands are clean for the next part because we're going to be rubbing it all together with our hands. Now once we've mixed it all together, the next part is I just want you to tear off some of the mince and I don't want you to make big meatballs because we want them to fit in the sub. So just roll up the small ones in your hands, about that size there. And just keep repeating that process until all the mince has gone. So we're going to start browning off our meatballs. Now into a large pan, I've just got some olive oil here and I'm just going to put it over. So guys, just grab your meatballs and just place them in the pan. And what we want guys is just some nice colour on the outside. You'll only want to cook these for about three to four minutes and just keep rolling them around. So guys, just turn the heat down after they've finished. Now, they're not cooked all the way through because we don't want them too tough. So just pick them up, put them on a plate and put them aside. But once the meatballs are out, turn the heat up once again. And we're going to be adding in some green onion, some spring onion that I've just chopped up very finely. Next, I'm going to add in some celery, which again, I've just chopped up finely. And next, I've got some grated carrots. Now guys, you want to cook off these vegetables for about four minutes, just until the onion starts to soften and that celery is also soft as well. Now after four minutes guys, I'm going to be adding in some tomato paste. And I've just mixed some water in with the tomato paste, I'm going to add in just a tiny bit of water as well. And again, give that a good mix around. So we've just warmed through that tomato paste with the water and now we're going to add back in our meatballs and just mix the meatballs with that tomato paste. I'm just going to let this warm through for about two minutes on a medium heat. That's all it will need, just another two minutes and guys then we're going to serve this bad boy up. So guys, I've just got a ordinary hot dog roll or torpedo roll or whatever you want to call it and I've just toasted it. You need to grab one of the meatballs and just place them straight on. And just over the meatballs guys, just grab some of that sauce that we made over the top. Now guys, you don't have to do this, it is optional, but I am just going to put over just a small amount of grated cheddar cheese. If you wanted to put parmesan, it's your call. So there you have it guys, my really quick and easy meatball subs. Let's give this a try. Look at that, beautiful. Mm. Oh, so, so good. All the ingredients are below, so check it out. You guys take care, and I am going to be taking a couple of weeks off from cooking, but I will be back in two weeks time. So until then, you guys take care.